Hi everybody, it's Tim at Vlogistics, and I've got another exciting announcement for you today. Now, a few weeks ago we launched our beta for the new version of VicNet. That's been going really well. Our development team has been cranking out updates based on the feedback we've been getting and the usage data we've been collecting, so that's really good. If you're not in that beta yet, you can check out the video introduction in the description below, and you'll get a sneak peek and see how you can get access to it. As I mentioned there, we're working on applying similar updates to the other volunteer facing parts of the system. The next piece is the opportunity directory and that is available right now. Now, if you're not familiar with it, the opportunity directory gives you a place to post information about your assignments publicly so anyone can view information about the tasks that are occurring at your organization. The new version makes the appearance a lot more modern and it includes a whole host of new features like a map, a schedule view listing openings, and social sharing options. Plus the whole thing is mobile responsive, so it looks great no matter what kind of device you're using. Now, unlike the new VicNet, we're actually starting this as an open beta. So it's available for everyone right now while we continue to make rapid improvements to it. Uh, so let's dive into the new opportunity directory together and we'll take a look at what this new version has to offer. You can find the URL for the new Opportunity Directory by going into Setup, Expanding Online Forms, and clicking Opportunity Directory. Here near the bottom of the page, you'll see the URL you need. Now highlight that to copy it, and then you can view it yourself in your browser, or you can send it out to anyone else you'd like for them to take a look. Once it's loaded, you'll see a list of your assignments over to the left, and the information about the assignments on the right. Now the information is separated out into these cards, which you can expand to see what you're interested in. You also have separate tabs for the profile, the schedule, and a map. It's not ready yet, but we're working on adding a documents tab here as well, where you'll be able to share the documents that you've uploaded for each assignment. On the schedule tab, you can show the unfilled openings for the assignment. Now these are just the available shifts, which can give your potential volunteers an idea of when they might actually be needed to fill in for this assignment. Also, you'll notice that the sites and places are listed on the left as well, and they're actually clickable. So your volunteers and potential volunteers can get more information about these parent categories, as well as the assignments themselves. When you visit the opportunity directory on a smaller screen, everything still fits nicely, and there's a menu here to select the assignments. And again, I wanna point out the share button here, which will allow your volunteers or you to easily share information about an assignment on Facebook or Twitter. Now, if you're on a mobile device, you'll also have your native share options here, which will work really well. You'll notice there are different options here for what you can share. They'll all bring visitors to this specific page on the opportunity directory, but if you choose listing only, then they won't see this menu on the side. They'll only see this one assignment. If you choose listing schedule only, then the visitor will be further restricted to just seeing the schedule for this one assignment. Of course, you can also customize the information that appears on the opportunity directory, and those options are in the same place we went to find the link. So again, we'll go to Setup, Expand Online Forms, and then click Opportunity Directory. Simply check what you want and uncheck what you don't, and be sure to click Save when you're done. And those changes will take effect the very next time the opportunity directory is loaded. Just keep in mind that right now, those settings will apply to both the old directory and the new one. So again, I'd like to encourage you to check out the new opportunity directory. It's a really big improvement over the current version and I think you'll like it a lot. If you have any feedback or you run into any issues, please let us know right away and keep an eye out here for more updates as we continue to roll these out. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.